I'm going to show you how to install this RCA, I think it's 1750F um, Slim Digital Amplified Antenna. It's indoors. It's pretty easy. Here's what you get in the box. You get the antenna, which is this big square piece here. This goes is a bracket that goes on the back and it makes it a stand if you want to just put it on a shelf. There's also holes in the back that you could hang it on. This is the amplifier and it's got a um, it's got a male, a female connector here, coax connector, and it has a plug to plug it into the wall. The antenna itself has a male coax connector on it, which actually will screw into the the uh, amplifier here, and then you screw this end right into the back of your um, coax connector in the back of your um, HDTV. It's pretty simple. I believe you do it with the instructions. Let's see. Here, on the, here are the instructions. It indicates step one is to find your location. For me, my location is facing northwest. You should go online to look up your address to see what's the best place to, or best direction to point the antenna in because it's omnidirectional. Second is you connect the antenna to the amplifier, which I just did. Third, you're going to connect the amplifier to the TV um, or your digital converter box. I'm going to just screw it into the coax connector in the back of my TV. Four, you plug in the amplifier's power supply. And five, you're gonna scan for channels and I'll show you how that's done. Okay, you're seeing a picture now and that's because I've already set this up, but I'm gonna show go through the menu. So I have my TV remote here my basic Vizio TV remote. And I'm going to just hit menu. And there's my options. I'm gonna go down to settings. I'm gonna pick the tuner, which is gonna be the antenna. See, I can go cable. Antenna, okay, so there's the antenna. I'm gonna scroll down to auto scan and it's just going to automatically scan her channels for me when it's done i will show you okay it just finished scanning it takes about two minutes and you can see i have 56 digital channels and one analog and the surprising thing is that the um, antenna is not that high. It's just about five feet up on the shelf. And it is actually facing away um, from north. So I tried it several different ways. I recommend that you also try it several different ways when you're scanning channels. Um, I scanned it in probably five different positions and actually you would think that scanning it higher would give me better reception but it didn't. So, um, so I scanned it several times. One thing you should know that even moving it slightly or tilting it in one direction or the other actually affected the signal and the channels I picked up. So you could hang it on a wall 
with the holes in the back and the screws that they give you, but then it would be static. And if you put it on a shelf like I have it, you can, um, from time to time, move it either way. I would assume weather might sometimes affect the signal, so you might have to just move it a little bit because it's omnidirectional. You might want to get, um, I would assume that they're called multi-directional antennas if you want to put something permanently. But here I am um, with 58 channels, 57 channels, and it's free, no cable. And I'm thrilled to death about it. And I'm, oh, by the way, I'm indoors in the center room in my house. I'm in a concrete block house and there are no windows in this room. So this is signal with the antenna at five feet high in the middle of a concrete block house. And I have 57 channels, including all the major networks. And Radio Shack told me um, that I wouldn't get NBC. I got NBC. I have all the major networks plus PBS, QVC, um, Home Shopping Network, PBS, uh, CW, and whatever to amount to. Um, oh, there's Trump. Oh, well. Oh, gee, that doesn't look good to amount to um, 57 channels. So, and you can see it's very clear, it's very sharp. You cannot tell the difference between this and cable. This is CBS, by the way. So I hope this video has been informative for you. I have a Radio Shack 1650 amplified in a room, in another room that's facing northwest and the antennas in the window, so I didn't need the $17.50, which only, it's only about $10 more. Um, but I did get the stronger one for the living room. So again, I hope this has been informative. You can see how easy it is to hook up. I would just recommend that you scan it, again, in a few different spots and a few different directions to see where you pick up the most channel. Hope I've helped. And... Um, I wish you all the best.